evening folks. I told you oh, I would be back a little bit later. Uh, welcome to Spilling Tea. I am your host, Tiffany Daniels, also known as the Lady Artist. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, folks, I've got some juicy info for you. If you haven't been on Twitter or you haven't seen the news yet, uh, Laura P. on Twitter has put up some wonderful news. So, it looks like A.H. is going to have to provide them receipts and her arrest records. Yes! 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 Okay, I'm good. So, this does go back to credibility. You remember when she was originally fighting discovery on those two things, uh, over the scope and all of her nonsense. And I said in that particular video that yes it does because these things do go to her credibility in regards to the op-ed, which is why she's being sued in the first place. Right? Well, Miss Thing is going to have to add up that information. So, very, very happy about that. Very happy about that. I was a little, I'm still angry earlier about that horrible freaking research study, but this was something that kind of calmed me down a little bit, got my brain thinking a little bit more logically, and other than the whole idea of expose them and resist the urge to find them in the street, yeah, yeah, I won't, I won't, but I won't say that the thought wasn't there. Anyway, so this is going to be interesting, folks. I wonder if she's going to try to fight it or if she's going to use this as an opportunity to smear him even further by saying, look at the power of the powerful man. No, dear, no. This just, just, just had enough of your crap. Alright. Alright. We've all had enough. And I am happy to see that finally there is someone with some kind of coherent, logical sense that is looking at this case that is involved with it. Because I'm not going to lie, her illogical nonsense and the illogic of her fans, whether, yes, I go over their tactics, but that doesn't mean their illogical nonsense does not just make me despair for humanity more than just a few levels. So, rant over, good news, provide receipts, provide the arrest records, and this is damaging on both ends. She can no longer hide behind the UK verdict. This is the US, dear, it's a whole different ball game. So, I'll be interested to see, does she actually have any receipts? A good majority of us think she doesn't have any receipts at all, but we'll see what she tries to do to get around it, or what kind of half-assed half proof she tries to put up in regards to the $7 million. But there's really no way to get around those arrest records. They are very telling, and they speak for themselves. So I wonder what these folks are going to do that are her supporters when their queen gets busted wide open for even the pandering media to see that she is actually guilty of the exact things she claimed that JD did to her. I think it's going to make them go, hmm, maybe we backed the wrong horse. Now. In regards to the media response to this, it could be one of two things. Either they dump her, they just completely throw under her bus, 
under the bus and say they were misled just like everybody else. Or they're going to turn this into a martyr situation. It depends on how far they want to back their narrative. They can either double down, call her a martyr, saying he's continuing to abuse her by making her dig up her past. Which I'm expecting that. I'm actually expecting that. Or they're going to throw her under the bus completely and act oblivious. So, collect those receipts, folks. Collect those receipts. So, if they do decide to play oblivious, we'll always be there to remind them. Alright, folks. So, that's really all I got for this evening. Now, with my previous video that I did earlier today, us autistic folk do really need your help. That study that was done on those toddlers was abusive and horrible and exploitive and it needs to be shared. People need to know what's going on, especially parents who, thinking the best of their doctors, want to go ahead and let their child do the study without being told what the study is about. They need to know that this is going on so that they know to ask questions. Alright folks, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the comments. You have a good one. Bye-bye. Oh yeah, and woo!